three good reasons. The first one is the quality. We have had universities for centuries, they keep progressing, they keep investing, and they are reviewed. We have a European process called the Bologna process, which looks at harmonizing but also testing the quality of universities. We have the latest methods, the latest tools, we have top libraries, facilities, and we are driven by research, which is a very important element. The second reason is, is, is comes from a report from the World Bank. The World Bank a few years ago said, the European Union is not a military superpower, it's not the biggest economic superpower, but it is a lifestyle superpower. So come and enjoy the lifestyle of Europe. You, you have a motto which is Pineka Tungalika. It is the same motto as the EU. United in diversity. So students who come to the EU, they can enjoy not only one university, but through Erasmus they can do an exchange and study in two countries. They can travel all around Schengen. They can try different food, different cultures. You can be one day in Rome, the next day in Paris, and the third day in, in Berlin or Madrid. This is unique. This is unique and it is a fantastic human experience, which is more than 50% of what studying abroad is. And then the third, and perhaps the most important, value for money. You know, it's only in Europe that education is universally accessible. It is only in Europe that we have such funding for public education. So all the member states invest heavily and the students coming in can benefit from that. Even the non-studying part, let's say healthcare. If you are ill in one of the countries that often receives Indonesian students, it will cost you 10 times, 10 times or 100 times what it will be in Europe, because in Europe basically health is free, healthcare is free. And in addition, we have here the participation of Indonesian International Student Mobility Awards. So there are opportunities of scholarship within Indonesia, but the best is that Europeans, either through Erasmus programs or member states programs, offer to one out of four students a scholarship to study in Europe. We are the biggest donor in terms of scholarship compared to the ratio of students going. And that is very important. And what is also something more specific in terms of gender is that we have more female students getting Erasmus scholarship than boys. So yeah, men have to study harder because women are better. And this we can see through our scholarship. So, quality, lifestyle, and value for money. I think this cannot be beaten.